good morning my vlog welcome back um so today i thought i would do kind of a vlog for you guys just kind of like show you what i'm doing i was planning on getting a lot done with my blog again today just because i kind of only have the weekends to do things just because i work full time during the week but i thought i'd start it out here and i'm going on a walk right now with my mom and my neighbor who's basically like my second mom she wants to go look at something i think from facebook market but I just wanted to show you guys my outfit. I just got this new outfit from Gymshark and I am loving these pants so much. And my matching sports bra, it's so freaking cute. And like, I can't really, I'll show you guys later, but it has such a cute top to it. But literally, orange is my favorite, favorite color right now. Um, I never really thought I loved orange that much, but... Honestly, getting these, I'm in love, and just like the past year, I've just been loving orange. Sorry, I guess my mirror's kind of a little dirty. I tried wiping it, but um, it's a new mirror, too. I was going to show you guys later. I kind of redesigned my room. As you can see, we're no no more green. No more green. Um, it's now like the mature me now. So, I'll show you guys a room tour. My room is kind of messy, as you can see. Um, didn't make my bed yet, and my desk is just, like, full of crap right now. So, I will give you a better room tour later and show you guys everything that I got, where I got it from, etc. And we will just go from there. So, I'll see you then. I'm vlogging today, my friends. That's so exciting. I know. This is Venice. She's my second mom. <laughs> <laughs> and this is my mom. You guys have seen her in my vlogs before. <laughs> well, we're taking our little stroll <laughs> right now. I'm in my bright orange. I already showed them I'm in my bright orange. Awesome. I showed them a picture of my outfit already. I mean, honestly, why do you this look like this to go? Sun is so hot. Because you got to dress up a little bit when you have nothing to like really dress up for. Am I right? Good point. Exactly. But I literally look like I just got out of bed because my face is so puffy right now. You literally did just get out of bed. I, well, I've been laying in bed for an hour, I think, just like looking at my phone because I don't usually get to do that. You don't. But oh, no. You're a working girl now. Yeah, I'm a working woman. I wake up at 7:15 and I work out and I go to work at 8:30. Right? Which way? Which oh, way are we going? Go oh, okay. Oh, I have something in my shoe. Uh, okay. I saw how the other night you and Ronnie left your flip flops at Kimmy's. Or no, at my house. We're not like extra. I'm carrying my coffee mug. No, I know. I'm just saying. Honestly, what is this woman doing? <laughs> There's a sidewalk right here. <laughs> and she purposely walks in the street. I'm the non conformist to the group. <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> All these pretty new houses. I like that one in the middle. I know, the middle one's really nice. I think that's pretty. Okay, so Venice had a question for you guys because she was just a little curious. I just wanted to know where the word vlogging derived from. Where we made that cute name up. I mean, I think it's because, so people always blog, which is like they write on a website and tell you about their life. But then this is like taking a video, so you just combine it, so it'd be vlogging because I'm videoing about my life, I guess. <laughs> She's happy with that answer. Laura, are you happy Good as answer. well? Good answer. Good answer. Thank you. That's what I thought. <laughs> so I figured I would just kind of talk to you guys while I'm waiting for my mom and Venice to look at this thing that they're gonna get on Facebook Marketplace. I think they're looking at like a dresser or something. Venice wants to get it for her house and just decorate because Venice is always constantly redecorating her house. Along with my mom. My mom always redecorates. Like she literally changes the house, I'd say every like three months. Maybe that's where I get it from, where I like cannot keep like one style like in my room for a long time just because I get tired of it and I wanna change it. But, um, yeah, so I'm kind of just like hanging out here right now. It's actually really nice outside. Outside, can I? I can't really talk. I'm not awake yet. Um, but this guy just came, so I just got kind of scared because the guy from the house just walked. What? Okay, I'm gonna walk away because 
I don't really know what to do right now. But we're just gonna, yeah, okay. Okay, I am back from the walk. This is the top I wanted to show you guys. Um, super cute, it has like this cutout kind of. It's actually like two different straps. Um, and then the back is like, this cross kind of I'm hoping you guys can kind of see it but it's like crisscrossed in the back but super cute it's a super cute set it's all from Gymshark and the pants are super like just like comfy and soft and it doesn't even want to focus right now but yeah it has this cool like line detail to them but super super cute set and I'm just in love with it as you could tell from earlier but um I'm going to sip my tea that my neighbor got me my other neighbor went to starbucks and got me a tea i get the venti iced guava white tea with no cane sugar at all and light ice just because it's already like super sweet and you don't need any more sweetener with this and it's just so good anyways um we're gonna actually go work out in my neighbor's garage right now with my mom and I think actually my two neighbors. Um, we're doing this like a thousand rep challenge. I really hope I don't die. I think I am just because I'm not used to like that kind of workout. I have like my own workouts that I like to do. So we will see how that goes. And I will catch you up later with that. Say hi. Hi vlog. Say hi vlog. Hi vlog. Yay. Do you want to say hi vlog Coop? Vlog. Yes! Yeah! Woohoo! Okay, it's been a couple hours since I ate lunch and then I ended up like showering, vacuuming. We like were late to watch the space rocket launch, but we kind of caught some of it. I got some footage a little bit of it. Not too much, but I wanted to show you guys all like my new decorations in my room and what I did. So to start out, I kind of originally, I don't think you guys could kind of see some of my room from some of my videos. But um, for the most part, my gr like you can see, like my room is gray. Um, 
I so we painted it gray a few years ago and then I was always obsessed with the color green I always liked the name I mean the name my last name is green but the color I always really liked it I always liked kind of a lime green color and it was very like earthy and I really liked that so that's kind of how I accented my room with like the gray walls and I put like just like green little accents throughout but I was kind of like you know what kind of done with this kind of ready for something like new and I was really digging like just like the tan and black and like neutral kind of vibes and then more like boho I guess like boho chic kind of um just like a lot of wood accents as well so that's kind of what I did I kind of like scavenged around like my house found some things that I really liked um, I think I, I kind of stole some stuff from my mom's room, um, but she wasn't using any of it. It was like all behind like chair, chairs and like in the attic and whatnot, so she wasn't really using it. But I was like, why not? Let's do that. And then I also got some things from Home Goods. So, no, not Home Goods. I got them from At Home. I always confuse the two, I always mix up the names. Um, but I'll show you guys everything I kind of like redid, what I did, and then I'll also like mention like where I got them from just so you guys can know. And um, I'll try to put links down below as well for things. Um, I'm hoping they all have them still, but we'll see when I look and whatnot. But at least you guys can know where I got them from and you can look for similar things if you want as well. Okay, so I guess the first thing I want to start out with is this mirror. Um, you guys saw earlier in this video, but it's brand new, and I got this from at home. As you can see, it has, like, a nice, like, black edge to it. Um, it's a really nice quality mirror, and it wasn't too expensive. And I think it looks really good in my room. I mean, it's super tall. Um can take great outfit pics fills up my wall pretty much but I actually used to have like a dresser right here that sat here and I ended up taking that dresser and moving it downstairs to my other closet that I have um, so now I have like a lot of my clothes downstairs just so I could have the space for this um, but as you can see then I also have a clothing rack here that I got I got this clothing rack from Amazon it was super affordable um, great quality and everything and then I also got like these hangers and everything from Amazon as well um, love these hangers too because they're like the non-slip hangers and they're just the best but yeah so that's kind of like this little corner of my room and I also ended up painting that star it was a lime green so now it's black and it just looks much better there and kind of like ties it in and as you can see I kind of so like I found this like wooden basket in my basement and I just like stuffed one of my like random gray blankets that I wasn't using and put it down there um, I also added, so I have this kind of pot with then these like decorative like sticks, I guess. Um, so this pot, my mom actually, she made this in high school. So this was one of the things that was upstairs in her room and she had it behind a chair. So like no one could really see it anyways. And I was like, I really want to have this in my room. So I just kind of grabbed it. I mean, of course I asked her and so now we have that there. Um, here we have, oops, um, if it wants to focus, I, so I kind of did all my jewelry. Again, this was for my mom, so don't know where that came from. She was using it at her desk. She was like, hey, do you want to use it? So I'm using it right now. Um, and I really like the way it looks. It just kind of like goes very well with like the theme of my room and everything. So it looks nice. And then I just have like my perfume, lotion, candles, and whatnot love 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 these candles I think I got I actually got those from either home goods or Marshall's so that's where I got them and I love those candles um, but yeah this is like my desk that I do my makeup at and I just like do work at and whatever in my other corner here I so I also like got these art books from my mom I took them from her um, this is my sketchbook so just like layering the books I love this look and I think it looks so like chic and elegant um, and then I just have like my lotion and then you can see right here are like two pictures I like like not having them put up on the wall just because I think it looks nice just having them layered in this corner and down um, I actually drew 
both of these and I like just being able to like show off my art in my room and I think it's really cool and I love how it's just black and white so it's super simple and it just goes with everything and I just have like my rings and like my mirror and close-up mirror sitting there um now for my like cube thing I don't really know what I want to call it <laughs> um I kept the same like green boxes I guess um, just because I didn't really want to spend money on getting, like, new ones, and they're really nice, but I got these from Target a while ago. But they're great quality, and they work really well, and they hold a lot of clothes. Um, and then in this one, I ended up rearranging it, and I found, once again, I found this in my basement. Um, I need to fix that picture. I want it to go up and down, and as you can see, I had an old skating picture in there, so I need to change that up. But, just these cute little dainty gold things and then this candle which is super cute a friend of mine makes these candles and they're amazing they're a hundred percent soy wax um if you want to see ooh, it's the lemon one and you can do like a custom label so i wanted fresh and clean which is super cute so yeah that's what i have there and i just put it there because i like the look of the glass jar on it and whatnot and then i have my skating little box all my little knickknacks from skating when I did that. And then up here, I put this huge frame, which I need to figure out what I want to put in it. I was kind of thinking that I was going to do, like, a collage of just, like, photos. I was thinking that um, I could, like, just get a lot of photos and maybe do, like, black and white or some kind of filter on them just to kind of go with that because I actually really like the background of it and I think it goes pretty well but once again I paired it up with another candle that I love it smells so good um and just like this vase with more like just decorative sticks and whatnot um here I have more of my drawings I have them on display and then just like random pictures of me when I was little they're just like kind of funny different like attitude pictures <laughs> you can tell but how we made this, I actually made this with my mom a while ago, and basic, so like, this is basically just a fence, like a piece of a fence, and we spray painted it black. Um, I know now they're making like more like decorative things for it, but that is very simple, DIY, do it yourself, and it turns out great, and it looks great as well. I mean, how awesome is this? It literally shows off all of my like, art and everything, and it's so easy, I just clip it on with these little guys and it works which is awesome love that okay next little part that I want to do actually I guess we can do the side table that I have this fan is kind of just there I have to have a fan when I sleep so we're gonna have to deal with it but I really liked the way this ended up looking and the way like the beads and everything I actually got this is a necklace so it's not like a string of beads or anything but I just kind of wanted to make it look that way and I just paired it up with some like gold bracelets in there but that necklace I think I got that I got that in one of the Caribbean islands when I was vacationing there. So awesome because it kind of just reminds me of vacation and whatnot. And it looks really good and it's the wood accent. And yeah, I love that. Um, now up here above my bed, my mom and I made this shelf, which is super cool. We just took like industrial pipe and then we took a wood plank and just painted it white. And now I have this awesome shelf here. Um, I'm actually going to get on my bed to show you guys, but yeah, so I got these little, this pot thing and this like not, um, well, I guess that's not a pot. That's like a vase. Um, geez, I need to get my words right. And this like not thing and then this pot as well, all of that stuff came from at home. This like wooden box came from my living room. That's what I took from my living room. My mom wasn't too happy about it, but I think it looks good. Um, more drawings and paintings and stuff. Um, and then I have a candle and another plant right here. And this pot as well is at home too. So got all that stuff from there. I reframed this and put this picture in here, which I think is super cool. So this is in Paris, and I was actually looking through, um, I was looking through, like, my 
mom and dad's old scrapbooks and stuff from when they were in college and like right when they got out of college and were dating and everything and right when my mom graduated my dad still had a year left of college and he went and studied abroad in England and when he was in England he went to Paris and he ended up taking that picture and I think it's so cool it's such a little like just vintage picture and it's just it reminds me of when I went there because I went and traveled by myself actually like two summers ago um, and I studied abroad in Barcelona but I went to Paris and I remember just like looking down the street and looking at the Arc de Triomphe if I'm saying that right and it was just it's so cool I love that and I love having that in my room like that I'm kind of hoping I can add some more like travel knickknacks to my room as well um, and then last little thing is just like my side table. This is the one I use because um, it just kind of is a better side table than my other one over there. But just have my basics on here. I have like my facial roller, just some like watches and stuff. And then some more candles because I'm obsessed with candles, that's for sure. But that's kind of all that I did to my room not a lot didn't have to paint it didn't have to like buy too many things but I think it like totally transformed my room and just made it into just like a more mature room I'd say I feel like it's more like now my age and like how I want it to be at least for the next few months or so I guess until I change my mind I don't think it'll let it'll last longer than a few months for sure but I'm just really loving it right now and I just kind of wanted to show it off to you guys because I'm kind of proud of my design skills with that so yeah <laughs> but once again I'll try linking everything down below a lot of the things I don't know where they came from just because I got them around the house like I said but I'll link as much as I can so you guys can check them out and if you have any questions about like the DIY projects or whatever just like let me know I'd love to share like any like instructions or just like information on how to do them because they're super easy but they're great accents and additions to a room if you want to like do anything or change up something in yours. So I just kind of stopped um, blogging, or not blogging, yeah, blogging I guess, and just like working on just like posts and whatnot. I ended up taking a few pictures with my mom. I don't know if I really like them. I kind of didn't put enough effort into them. As you can see, I literally did not do my hair or my makeup, so I just tried to do something and I put on some clothes. But with the posts that I'm going to do, I don't really like... I don't like the way the photos came out for it but I'm doing another post and that's why I was taking pictures of the sunglasses they ended up I got like the um, cover shot and I really like the way it looks this is how eh, you can kind of see it a little bit oh that's so much better yeah so I really like the way it turned out um, and I'll have to get some other pictures just for that post and do that but I was just kind of working on that just a little bit just because I haven't done some vlogging in a while and I need to get some posts up because June 1st is literally in what two days I think oh my hair's a little messed up um June 1st is in two days and on the first of every month I send out a newsletter to everyone that's on my mailing list with like all the blog posts that I've made in the month and so I really try to get I don't like doing this, but if I haven't posted a lot, I try to get in posts just before that newsletter so you guys at least get to see new posts if you didn't see them at all. 
Um, I'm trying to get more on like a weekly basis with things and trying to do posts like more. Um, so it's like every week is a new post. Um, and I'll kind of start setting that up once I get to like writing more and whatnot. It's just been kind of chaotic with um, everything going on lately. So I'm going to try to get that on schedule and get that going. But yeah, so today I just kind of did photos and just did a little like minor details to things and little work but I'm sure tomorrow I'll work it on it some more definitely and just kind of like um maybe write some vlogs and get caught up on that too okay exciting news I got my cap and gown in the mail I'm gonna go try it on right now um so as you guys know all graduations have obviously been canceled and I graduated from college yay um in I'd say it was in April. I was done in April. Graduation was supposed to be in May, but um, so I graduated from Oakland University, but they changed their graduation, so the commencement is supposed to be like later in August. So instead of going to no your normal like commencement fair, you know, like you usually do, um, they had to set, like you had to order the, your cap and gown online, and then it would get shipped to you in the mail. But I actually ordered mine just like this past week and I didn't think it would come this quick so kind of excited about that but I'm gonna try it on and I have it on yay oh my gosh it's official I'm a college graduate <laughs> oh my gosh this is kind of crazy but this is cool maybe I should decorate my cap I don't know we'll see I don't know we'll see ah okay we're gonna go we're gonna go show my mom. Let's see what this woman says about my attire. Okay, this is definitely gonna like fall, I feel like. But then you like pull it down too much and then it's a problem. Yeah, this is not the most flattering look for me. But, and we have my awful hair that's not even done anymore. But let's see, ooh, let's see what she thinks. Oh, look at my doggy. He's happy. She's on the phone. Well, she looks kind of excited, but I can't really see a reaction from her. Oh well. Um, I guess we'll see you later. At least my dog likes it. <laughs> what do you think? She's gonna take a picture of me right now. Of course I am. Yeah. With my camera, my vlogging camera. <laughs> well, I guess I'll. <laughs> Weird. Four years of your life just gone like that. I said four years of your life just gone like that. Well, it's true. I mean, it did go by pretty quickly. But I'm going to go take this off because I don't want to ruin it before August when I have to wear this. So, yeah. Now I'm kind of hungry. I kind of want a snack. I haven't eaten anything since lunch and I'm just like kind of starving. And not quite time for dinner yet but um dinner should be ready in like I think about actually less than an hour I think but I think I'm gonna have a mango I need to find something that you can you can sit right here you can sit on top of my mom's essential oils so yeah, I'm just going to have a mango before dinner. I've been loving mangoes lately. And I kind of saw, so like, apparently there's like a mango cutter. Like, you know how you have, there's those apple cutters that, um, they're like the circle and then you just put them on top of the apple and then it cuts the apple in slices. Well, because the mango has like a pit in the middle of it, there's like one where you can just like put it on the mango and then it just slices through and doesn't get the pit. And then it's so much easier instead of like 
literally shaving the skin off, which is what I do each time. And I make such a big mess out of it because um, it's just a messy fruit, I guess. But um, yeah, so I guess we're going to try to get this done. It's definitely a freaking lot to do just to eat a fruit that takes like five seconds to eat. Eh, whatever. Hey guys, I'm back. It's been a couple hours. Um, I ended up going outside after I like had my mango and everything and just kind of chilled out there. Um, it got a little chilly, so I ended up coming inside, and that's why I have this big sweatshirt on right now, because I'm kind of cold. But we just ate dinner, just kind of sat down at the table, had classic dinner with the fam, and um, now I'm just kind of chilling. But I'm going to close out the vlog here today, just because I have a lot of content for you guys. It was a pretty jam-packed day, and I had a lot of fun just recording it and showing you guys everything that I did, so... If you guys like this, remember to like and also subscribe as well. And then I'll also have my Instagram handle right here too. So go and follow me there as well. But I hope you guys enjoyed this and I'll see you guys next time. Bye. <laughs>